Welcome back to MTFC TV. Joining me this time is Marcus Marshall. Marcus, it's been a, an indifferent few weeks. You had that penalty miss against Workington, and then you've come up trumps against Whitby with two goals. How are you feeling? Um, terrible at the time of the penalty miss. But you forget about it. Luckily, the lads dug me out. Big John up, dug us out of the crap, and then he's, he's gone back to Boston, bless him. But um, I gave him a big thank you. Um, Saturday, went to Whitby in. In the terrible conditions, Aww. I think we've done wonders. Yeah. And it was good to get two goals. Well, what goes through your head when so penalty miss happens? As a striker, does that affect your game? Does your head go down or do you keep going? I think at the time you just want the ground to swallow you up, but I think it rouses up them because they all get round their keeper, even though he's not made a save, he's, he's bloomed over the ball. They get round him, and they for the ten minutes after that they were all over us, but. For me, it made me work that much harder because I wanted to make up for it. And then, going into the Whitby game, was it in your head, I've got to make up for this? Or was it something uh, that you never really nah, thought of? It's gone. I know I've got goals in me. Just work hard for the team and, and hopefully the goals will come. Unfortunately, they, they did. You formed quite a dynamic partnership with Brooke Luke Kinsley last couple of games. Is he a player you like playing with? Yeah, he, he works hard. He's, he's honest as the day's long and... He's always got a chance of winning it in the year, so I just play off him. If he's not going to win it, then the defender might play it and, and you just play on that last man when he's playing. You, you made the switch earlier this season from a wide man to up front. You seem a lot happier up front. Is it fitting your game nicely playing in that? I think it is. Um, I've always knew I could play up top. I've played the bits and bobs out, uh, throughout my career, but I've always been just put on the wing for whatever reason. Hype, pace, I don't know, but I've really, really played up front at the minute. Um, I've got the pace to get in behind, I win my fair few headers, and I'm, I'm working hard up there. I think you're currently on eight league goals, I'm not sure how many cup goals off the top of my head. One. Uh, one, it's good Good that someone knows, <laughs> um, not keeping time. I was about to ask the question, do you set yourself a goal target? Um, well, I think to get to ten, um, from the start of the season, you want to set yourself to ten about now, but I didn't play up top until October, so I think I've done quite well to be fair, but... I'm just taking it every game as it comes now. I think I've got goals in every game, so that's my aim. I just want to be scoring goals and working hard for the team. Are you looking forward to the upcoming fixture against Stafford? Yeah, definitely. I think they're a team that's down there, they're struggling, so you always fancy um, getting a few goals against any team, but from a team where hopefully we want to see a bit more of the ball, there's going to be more chances for us. Right, thank you very much, Marcus Marshall. Thanks a lot, buddy.